obviously we heard a great deal about the Bank of England stepping in uh, like a, a hero at the at the eleventh hour to save our pension pots from kind of exploding or dissipating utterly. But they've also said today that they won't do anything else, and on Friday that's the end of it. So, what does that mean for people with money in pensions? Um, well, in terms of the pensions market, um, it's a very kind of it's confined to a very small part of the pension sector that's under specific stress that the Bank of England has sort of stepped in to uh, stabilise. Um, really, what we're seeing is that the Governor of the Bank of England, Andrew Bailey, has has set a, a cliff edge for Friday, and this is causing more jitters in the markets and and concern. Um, and all of this really relates to the mini budget, so it, we can't really separate it from that. There's still concern over the government's credibility around their unfunded tax cuts, and that's what's continuing to cause problems in the financial markets. Um, what we're seeing is the Bank of England and the Treasury are basically pulling in different directions, and we really need to see them work together to deal with the multiple crises we're facing, so instability in the financial markets, um, cost of living crisis, energy crisis, and now increasingly possible crisis around the housing market and mortgage rates rising. So the fact that they're both pulling in different directions is a big problem.